How are you seeing these markets broadly at the moment? Hi, Kyle. Yeah, look, it's been uh, an exciting week, that's for sure. Like the uh, the VIX index has been up above the, the 32 again, and we've seen the big moves on a lot of the key indices, actually. But I think from a standpoint of uh, technical setups, they're playing the game quite nicely, I think. So, yeah, all of the ones that I've highlighted today are, are fairly important uh, levels from a technical standpoint, but also given that we are you know, in the first week of uh, May, generally a week of time of the year anyway, uh, it's probably not really unexpected. Yeah, absolutely. So we'll kick things off straight away. And you've got a, a chart for us of the, S, uh, the S&P 500 that you'd like to take us through. What are you seeing there at the moment? Yeah, sure. So the S&P 500 has been an interesting chart. Uh, the last two days have seen a big, big volatility spike. We've basically seen replicated candles. Uh, we, we see a, a big red bullish can, uh, bearish candle from the previous day. A lot of this has got to do with the interest rate decision, of course. Uh, we know that the Fed met uh, in the middle of the week and interest rates uh, basically will put up 0.5%. I think them just saying that the uh, 0.75 was off the table at this point uh, generally gave the market a bit of a rally and a bit of a kickstart off a, a pretty good support base. But it went up and touched the 20 moving average, as you can see circled there. Uh, and realistically, that's generally you know, a sign that a potential reverse could kick in anyway, especially when we know that we're in a, a longer term downtrend. We can see the cross up there of the 20 and 50 EMA, which is the exponential moving averages. And once that happens, we generally see sustained weakness, especially uh, in May, like I say. So the interest rate decision certainly gave it a little bit of a kick along, but I think the market is probably, uh, yeah, really wanting to sell off anyway. So I think it's just probably looking for a reason to now.